basic idea was that we wanted to, to convey that the Ark was uh, really built in, uh, in haste. We took the Bible at its word for its dimensions, uh, which was a height, a length, and a width, uh, didn't give any indication of a design. And so we assumed, or we made the assumption, that all, all that space would be maximized and that Noah was really building a shipping container, a way to store these animals to weather a storm rather than a ship with a keel that looks like it's headed to a destination. And all Noah's really been instructed to do is build this thing and wait it out. Lastly, I think what we both wanted, Darren and I both wanted the Ark to be is a sort of brutalist uh, structure, something that was not made to be admired, something that was not built in honor of anything except the survival of what was in it. I don't think New York's ever seen a set like that, let alone an outdoor set like that. Drive on the LIE and you'd get off in Oyster Bay and you'd show up on set and you just entered another world. Our ark is built kind of more to the specifications described in the Bible than the houseboat that you see on cereal boxes. When the entire earth is flooded and there's water everywhere, there's nowhere to go. You're not sailing anywhere. So you really are just trying to float until the waters go down and then you land somewhere. So it didn't need a sail or a keel for directionality. It just needed, it was just a, ra a raft with a roof. It takes away this notion that you can go, so it's a much more passive, trapped, imprisoned kind of situation where you're really at the mercy of the waters receding. What are you doing out there? Right. Are you pulling your tip, David? Oh, you're still shooting, eh? Pulling one's tip is an expression used in Commonwealth countries. Or so can be pulling one's leg, and I'm sure you here in America understand that means one gets teased. Yes. <laughs> so David was having his tit pulled by members of the crew. He actually quite enjoys that. Yes, in fact, he's a big fan of it. Though doing it because he himself likes it.